Hey everyone, so in this video I wanted to share a quick tip for making sure that your text wraps in a data entry field. And so here we have a little interaction. I'm going to add a data entry field right here in the speech bubble. So I'm going to go up to insert, input, data entry, and then I'm just going to draw my data entry field and I am going to format it so that it is, uh, sorry, so that it is solid, a solid fill of the background color. Okay, cool. So we've got that, and we're also going to take the outline off. No outline, and we'll bump up the font. So this is a text data entry field, and what you'll notice if you go into Format, so select the text entry uh, and then Format, you're going to go to Text Box, and you'll see that Multi-Line is selected. That means that wrapping is going to occur. So if you're used to looking for uh, word wrap or text wrap, it is now called multi-line in Articulate Storyline 360. This was a change made, I believe, in the November 2023 update. So if you notice that your text is not wrapping for a um, data entry field, it's likely because this is deselected. So I'll just uh, deselect that and I'm going to, oops, sorry. I'm going to just preview this so that I can show you. And so what we're going to see is as we start typing, when we get to uh, the end, it's going to just keep going uh, horizontally versus wrapping and going vertically. So let's close out of preview. And then we're going to go back into format shape and text box. And we're going to enable multi-line, which again is the default. But if you've encountered a horizontal kind of typing in these fields, it's likely because this is not selected. So we're going to close out of that, preview again, and we're going to see that uh, when we reach the end of the bounds of the data entry field, uh, the text is going to just continue wrapping so that it uh, goes down horizontally.